truth, mate. Greg Hunt, Aussie Health Minister, has had his vaccine. Well, he had it on the 8th of March. He tweeted, Yesterday, Dr Vanessa Haller, aged care nurses Tracy, Thurza and Beck, clinic cleaner Derek, former Prime Minister Gillard, Professor Brendan Murphy and I, had the privilege of being vaccinated against COVID-19 with the AstraZeneca vaccine. On the 10th of March, Aussie time, the news.com.au website reported, Greg Hunt diagnosed with bacterial infection, remains in hospital. And the subheading goes, Health Minister Greg Hunt has ended speculation his hospitalisation was linked to a COVID-19 vaccine, revealing why he was admitted. On the 9th of March, UK time, the Daily Mail in its usual fashion reported, Grim details of Health Minister Greg Hunt's serious infection are revealed as he recovers in hospital days after getting his Covid vaccine. So both articles mention the vaccine and both say officials deny any links to it. Hunt suffered with cellulitis. According to MSN News, cellulitis is a spreading inflammation of the skin, usually caused by a bacterial infection. And if you've got it, there's a pretty good chance you'll know about it. The UK government's vaccine adverse reaction page allows you to download reports of the various vaccines. There is one incident of non-fatal cellulitis from the AstraZeneca vaccine, so it is a possibility he got it from that, albeit a very rare one. I found the following video on Facebook. I'm not sure when or on what channel this first appeared, but here's what the man himself had to say about the vaccine. Um, so the world will, is engaged in the largest uh, clinical trial, the largest global vaccination trial ever. Hold on there, Greg. What was that you just said? Um, so the world will, is engaged in the largest uh, clinical trial, the largest global vaccination trial ever. That's what I thought you said. The largest global vaccination trial ever. Um, so mm. The world will, is engaged in the largest... Uh, clinical trial, the largest global vaccination trial ever, and we will have uh, enormous amounts of data. But what's the message for the public? It's safe, it's effective, it will help protect you, but it will also help protect your mum and dad, your grandparents, uh, your nonna, uh, all okay. of Australia. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you can see when new videos come up. As always in my videos, I suggest you do your own research on this subject as well. Look at the links in the description below and also make your own mind up. And take a trip further down the rabbit hole.